the mighty Avro Lincoln towers over the diminutive Fiesle Storch in RAF Cosford. Beside the Storch is the smallest aircraft of World War II, the Fokker Ach FA 330. Weighing only 68 kilograms, similar to the weight of the pilot, the FA-330 was carried by German U-boats as an aerial observation platform to extend their horizon. This enabled the sub to select targets of opportunity and manoeuvre into position without revealing its presence. U-boats could travel twice as fast as a typical convoy whilst surfaced, but struggled to keep up submerged. An extended horizon would give the U-boat a crucial advantage. As an unpowered gyroglider, the FA-330 took to the air by being towed behind the U-boat. Altitude was limited by the length of tether, typically a few hundred feet. Ground speed would be the same as the submarine, so a reasonable headwind was required to provide sufficient lift. Transported in sections, the aircraft was assembled and disassembled on the sub's deck before and after every flight. This complex operation took 20 minutes, so it precluded use of the FA-330 in the North Atlantic and Mediterranean, where Allied air patrols were on overwatch. The South Atlantic and Indian Ocean were more suited to the FA-330, but only one successful use was recorded by U-177 off Madagascar in 1943. Approximately 200 aircraft were constructed, and quite surprisingly, at least a dozen survive in air museums. RAF Museum Cosford is free to visit and is a great day out. We'd like to thank the museum staff who enabled the close-up walk-around of the FA-330. Please subscribe to History Needs You for more history, heritage and forgotten aircraft.